Tickle vs. Giggle, what a possible case name. This is coming from Australia. So Giggle is an app that advertises itself as a women's only app. And they decide whether you're allowed in the app by an AI that decides if you're a woman. Now Sal Grover, the businesswoman who runs the app, from my reading, says she decided to base it on sex at birth, not gender, therefore allowing cis women and trans men to use the app. Now, there were plenty of complaints about discrimination. Of course, discrimination against trans women, but also it rejected a high number of women who just simply weren't white. Multiple news stories I saw on that. Now, what's bringing this Tickle vs. Giggle case? Well, part of it is the tweet exchange behind me. So here you have Roxy Tickle saying that trans women are legally women, both morally and legally. And if you have a problem with it, talk to the government. And here's Sal Grover, the one who runs the app. Another issue involved is the fact that uh, the app, Giggle, run by Sal Grover, actually let Roxy Tickle join. The AI agreed that Roxy Tickle was a woman and then was manually removed from Giggle. This led to a complaint to the Australian Human Rights Commission and Sal Grover did in fact know that this complaint happened. And this complaint was never closed because Sal Grover refused to attend gender identity re-education and open her app to trans women. That's the explanation I've seen in multiple stories. Because I've done some digging. If you look at the dates, these are in 2021. This has been a long evolving story. So I had to do quite a bit of digging to find out what was going on. Now, Roxy Tickle has filed for a federal court hearing against Sal Grover. Roxy Tickle wants damages a written apology, and access to Giggle. Sal Grover's planned defense, it sounds like, is to say they did not discriminate on gender, which would have been illegal. They discriminated on sex, which they believe they are legally allowed to do. And it's becoming a thing again. It's being talked about more because Sal Grover is tweeted this. I'm being taken to federal court for saying no to males in the female-only space I create. I'm fighting for all females in Australia to have access to female-only spaces, services, and support. I very much appreciate your support, heart. And giggledcrowdfund.com. So when you see Tickle vs. Giggle, if you see it trending, or you see turf spreading it, or you see the far right in America spreading it, it's an Australian court case, and this is what's going on.